has this really lovely fruity strawberry aftertaste. We're here in Cairns with Steve Trenary and I have this beautiful fruit that we've just tried. And Steve, what can you tell me about this stunning looking Anona? Well, this is Anona uh, diversifolia. Uh, other common name is Elama, and this is the red version. Uh, you get pink and you get white, but these ones taste uh, like raspberry, strawberry sort of flavor. Uh, they have a gray skin on them. And when they're ripe, they split on the tree, so. You so you know when to pick it? Well, if you don't pick it, it'll fall off and splatter. I think it's not only one of the most beautiful fruit that I've ever seen, but it certainly is one of the best things we've tried here today. But yeah, you've got some beautiful jaboticabas and some really interesting plants. Starting to get a bit passionate and collecting whatever I can get my hands on, so there's a lot of stuff out there if you look. Worth growing a tree. If you're thinking of growing a custard apple, this is one that you should grow because it tastes so much better than your average fruit. And you're not going to find that in the shop, so that's another really that's good right. reason to grow something. How many types of jaboticabra have you got that you've shown us here today? Uh, so far, probably 35, roughly, different types. So there's a lot more to collect, but it's just hard to get them. I'm, I'm looking for people who can give me a new one and I'll trade something for the new one and I'll eventually I'll grow them uh, to produce seed and fruit or graft them onto a, a, a more common rootstock and maybe spread all the different types around so everyone's got them. So, so if you're out there and you grow your body carvers, get in touch with us and get in touch with yeah, Steve and yeah. let us know. So many different types, different flavours, coffee flavour, uh, icing sugar flavour, all sorts. Coffee flavoured your body carver. What more could you want? <laughs> I better start on that one first. Fantastic. <laughs> Thanks Steve. Thanks very much Thank for you. having us here today. Yep. It's been fantastic.